Hey guys, uh, apparently a lot of you guys really liked my uh, light pack with my Xbox One demo. So i uh, got a couple of questions people want me to answer, show my setup, so I'll try to make it quick while also informative because uh, I know a lot of you are now interested in purchasing a light pack and so I'll be more than happy to fill you in on that. Uh, so for starters, here we are, we're back with my Xbox One and uh, one of the questions I was getting is does it only work with games on Xbox One? Can it work with Blu-rays, YouTube, things like that? And the answer is yes. Anything that's coming through your Xbox One, whether you're playing a movie, you're playing a game, watching a video, on the market, it doesn't matter, it will work. So as you can see, I can nav navigate around and my light pack reacts appropriately. Um, just go to my games and apps. So as you can see, I got like the green over there and so it's capturing all of that. So as I scroll through, it's actually giving a pretty cool rainbow effect. So it's it, it works with everything. Go on YouTube, big red image. And I'm not going to turn a video on for copyright purposes, but uh, as you can see, it's, it's functioning. It's even got a little bit of a glow from the background. So all of that's working and in place. Uh, it works flawlessly. I'm very impressed, quite honestly. So let me show you the actual process. You know, the light's turned on. Okay. <clears throat> so bear with me because I haven't gotten things prettied up. The setup is still pretty rudimentary at the moment. Uh, so cords are tangled, all that sorts of stuff. But uh, just bear with me on that. So for starters, uh, we have, coming from the Xbox, we have a single HDMI cord on the back. That HDMI cord is then going to a splitter box, which a splitter box is in a very awkward location, so you're just going to have to take my word on it. It's an HDMI splitter. Very simple. I have links to all the things I, I'm using here, also on the Reddit post, which I'll put in the description of this video if you're not here from it. Um, so going from the Xbox to a uh, splitter, one side of the splitter is going off up here in the back, and then it's a side of the TV, so that way we can see the Xbox in full 1080p glory. Fantastic. The other side of the HDMI splitter is coming off as an HDMI cord into, you have to bear with me here, <clears throat> it's going to be a little dark. Okay, so it goes here into this uh, converter. Now, as you can see, it says HDMI to AV. It converts the HDMI cord here on the left to these AV composite cords on the right. So it converts those, uh, this entire signal, uh, into that. And then upon doing so, I can then take it from here and go into my capture card. And so uh, this is a com uh, standard definition composite capture card. It's pretty old, quite honestly. This is known as a Dazzle. Um, they're pretty rudimentary, but as you can see, it works for this flawlessly. Uh, we'll get to that in a moment. So uh, it plugs right in there. You even got the audio for it too. And then that is just USB and plugs right over here into my PC, right in the back. And so let's go ahead and take a look at our PC view of things. There we go. So this is what my computer's seeing. And as you can see, it has scan lines in it. It looks really fuzzy um, and honestly not that great compared to the crisp 1080p. But at the same time, it doesn't look that bad per se. Um, what's really important is the color. And so as you can see, we have color here on the left. That's being shown on the wall. Um, let me navigate around a little more. And as you can see, it's capturing all the color in my PC. So let me minimize this window. So this is just my desktop. So everything works fantastic. Uh, now as for latency, there is a slight bit of latency because it's going through a USB port, but honestly, it's not that much. Let me see if I can give you a good demonstration of how much latency there is. It's definitely playable. And it's hard to perceive, especially when you're playing and your eyes are focused on the screen, you're not gonna notice it. Uh, and then other than that, you just have the light pack plugged in and set up. You get the software, which is known as Prismatic. You open it up, you configure the zones, 
and then you full screen that the video and next thing you know you got your Xbox shining on your walls it works fantastic any uh, other questions or concerns by all means feel free to uh, contact me whether it be here or on reddit and I'll answer any and all questions uh, in the meantime I hope some of you really like this and I hope uh, those of you who are getting it love it just as much as I do because I tell you this is pretty fantastic now uh, another thing is uh, you can adjust I know mine are very sensitive so they change the slightest little bit of color you can change it where they fade very gradually and they really help when it's dark and it helps the TV not pop off the wall too much it helps your eyes adjust and it really helps emphasize the game so that would along with good surround sound setup 1080p television it's a pretty good pretty good get up and I can't argue with it got something exciting to put with my brand new Xbox one but all right guys I'm not gonna drag this on too long it's already been six minutes I uh, hope you enjoyed and feel free to have any questions or concerns I'll answer them all thank you